I'm Jessica Dahlcourt for CNET, here with Josh Stone of Root Metrics. Now, they partner with CNET to provide the coverage maps that you see for mobile phones on CNET.com. And I'm going to see just how they independently test the signal strength and the data connections for all the cell phone carriers in the area. So, Josh, this is a pretty big yeah. briefcase here, and I see that you've got a bunch of phones and battery packs strapped to it. What am I looking at? Our kit starts with off-the-shelf consumer phones. There's a phone for each of the major carriers we're testing in the market, and all of them are connected to this master device. It's actually controlling and automating calls, and each of these phones uh, is running our proprietary software and collecting samples around signal, data, and texting. What we typically do is we run in a, a proprietary software. This randomly selects waypoints along a route for the drivers. They're able to plan their routes and select three indoor locations at each waypoint um, that are publicly available, like a supermarket, a gas station, that kind of thing. So right now I see that these phones, most of them look like they're calling a phone number. Mm -hmm. What are they doing exactly? The, these are actually calling a, uh, a server and holding an actual call and testing the signal string back to that server at the same time. So they're going to upload, what, photos, videos? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So every five minutes we will have run through signal strength, data, uploads and downloads, speeds, and text performance. Now, do the carriers actually use your data to go ahead and find out where their weak spots are so that they can improve their network? They can and do use that reporting to and improve technology throughout the markets. Great. Thank you so much. This has been really fun. Thank you. I'm Jessica Dahlcourt for CNET. You can catch all of our content at CNET.com.